other children. So it's best I don't go sit on hip here and dox other people because just in case they might dox me back. That's your responsibility. And I'm so sick and tired of these parents on here. Yeah, because they've got children. Yeah, not taking responsibility for their fucking actions. Yeah, putting their children on TikTok. Then someone records it. Someone reports it to social services and then complaining about it but you put your children on social on, on this tiktok and the same with fucking doxing don't dox it's that simple and ems was correct what's good what's good for the goose is good for the, for the fucking gander yeah your responsibility if you've got children don't dox because i've got an elderly mother and that's also a serious crime all right, no parent should be sitting here doxing. It's your own responsibility. That's all I've got to say on it. <laughs> Absolutely, thank you, Eternity. Absolutely, don't sit there fucking thinking I can go dox ten people today because they don't have children, but they can't dox me. I've got children because if they do, I'm going to cry like a baby, yeah, and s shout out, "I've got children! I've got children!" They don't fucking dox then. It's that simple. Be a responsible parent. If you don't want it back, don't do it. Sick of this fucking app. I'm not in the mood. Sorry, guys. I fucking... <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. It's true. I'm sick of Michelle sitting on a fucking eye all saying, but Torian's got children. Torian's got children. Then sh why is she fucking doxing other people then? How? I have a niece. I have a fucking niece, you fat bitch. Oh, my God. I'm definitely going to get banana I have a, I have a niece. She visits this house. She came over three fucking days ago. So you're sitting on your little high horse, Michelle, yeah, saying, but Angie's all over the internet, it's okay, she's all over the internet. Well, it's not okay, it's not, without my permission, whether it's in the public eye or not. I'm sure your number's in that 192 phone book, Michelle. Is that public? Because I, I, I bet people can find it on here. So should we dox you? No, right? You get my permission, I don't give a shit thinking well it's only angie it's okay it doesn't matter she makes me sick oh, she really does i can't stand that woman she's gone on and on and at me at me for god knows how long this obsession that she is weird oh they can watch me as much as she wants oh the weird I tried to do a blackout on me <laughs> Yeah, I mean, don't fucking think you can sit there doxing me and get away with it. Nah, fuck that. <laughs> I'm having a rant. Oh my God, I miss my rants. <laughs> Aaron had a good rant for ages. I feel better now. <laughs> I feel so much better. Oh God, use a piss off, you weirdo. Get out of here. Isn't it? I've already done it. It's pretty if you keep requesting me. And it's another thing. And let me tell you another thing that I'm going to be talking about, right? It's another thing here, yeah? Is that you think, I'll put this on Saboni in, uh, in a minute, and then you can pay to troll, yeah? Another thing, I get on with that, that, that tea, yeah? Requesting me over and over again, yeah? Wanting to get me on, okay? And then first thing is, I'm abusive to my mother. And I, because I said, what do you want? Do you know what I mean? I don't want to be battling with you two, <laughs> you know what I mean? And it's like, you abuse your mother. So if you don't want your parents mentioned... Yeah, why are you mentioning mine? But yet you want to come on the next day crying like a baby that someone has spoke about my deceased parent, but you think it's okay to be speaking about other people's parents. I mean, you shouldn't be talking about parents full stop, whether they're here or not. So if you don't like, if you're so affected and triggered, here's a thought, don't talk about other people's parents. <laughs> you know what I mean? And that's how, that's how it all started. I mean, I don't dox, I don't break the law. I don't do that. But you doxed me tonight on, on a, a platform of 6K. That will go to the police. A thousand percent. You know what I mean? Just because it's on it doesn't matter. It does not make any difference. 
And I hadn't done anything. I hadn't doxed no one. Do you know what I'm saying? But let me tell you something, T. Next person you dox, I can guarantee they'll probably dox you back. They wouldn't give no shits. You know what I mean? I have my niece coming over here. My niece fucking visits my mother. So there's a kid in this house, right? Not in the house. The kid don't live in the house. But she visits the house. Yeah? So you have dox a child, haven't you, T? In some ways. Because I'm sick of people saying, but you don't have children, it's okay, you don't have children. But what about children that visit? How do you know that my niece is a child that's not going to, that's, you know, if something happens, is not going to be in the house? I've also got my elderly mother. So that will be reported to the police. Yeah, just like you like to run to the police about racism. Oh my God, I'm really on one tonight. <laughs> Ah, oh, my God. What shadow? <laughs> the shadow on the wall, is that what you're looking at? Oh, for fuck's sake. It's my legs. Oh, it's my pillow. Ow, <laughs> what the hell? Oh, my God. I wonder what you keep saying about shadow. <laughs> So you're making me laugh now, for God's sake. I'm, me I'm meant to be angry, and you know, stop making me laugh. All you wanted was a quiet island. Listen, I'm, over I'm fine, listen. Does it really bother me? No. Yeah? But I will report it. Do you hear what I'm saying? Because she's done it, she's done it maliciously as well. Well, she's, she's done it, isn't it? So I've got the screen recording. Who's M? M is watching. Who's M? You have the craziest shadow of shadows. Oh, yeah, because I do Buddhism and that Buddhism, yeah. So it's probably, yeah, I get all these shadows and stuff. I've got these, um, what do they call them? Voodoo dolls. <laughs> Don't piss me off, guys. <sighs> Thank you, Frankie. I have this have of you doxing your mum didn't post. I have the screen recording of you doxing your mum. How can I dox my mum? I live in the same house. I own half the the house, love. Um, so what are you talking about? I don't care what I've leaked on here. You have no right to be re-leaking it or reposting it or doxing it. It's still called doxing because it's my private information that I've not given you to spread around or to share to someone that could be a psychopath or someone that might join just today or just in the next five minutes who could be a psychopath. You need my permission to share my my address around. My niece comes here, so you she, Torian has doxed children. Yeah, because my, my niece does come to this house. Just because I don't always go downstairs, there are times she is here. But why should I have to tell people that? I shouldn't have to tell Torian, please don't dox me. I have my niece that comes here. Why should I have to tell her that? You shouldn't be doing it in the first place. <laughs> it's not public inflation. K. Carroll is doxing. Maybe you need to go read it, uh, to, uh, read uh, Google Doxing. It's basically, doxing isn't public info. You think doxing, you, you've, you've got in your head, guys, that um, doxing, you can't dox what's already out there, that's public, that's incorrect. Doxing is of any private information. It's like, if I was to read an article that's in the public eye, and I'm not talking about the newspaper like a, a celebrity, but I'm talking about, say, for example, someone is in the article, like somebody on here, and they don't want their name known, so they're under whatever it could be, yeah. And I'm reading an article, yeah, that they're, they're in this article, and it's public information, right? But what I cannot do is read out the address or personal information on the article, even though it's public yeah, because that person should be, be able to remain, you know, well, you know, um, thingy-bob, you know. So that's classless doxing. 
because even though the address is in an article, yeah, that's their private information, and that person doesn't want you to know the address. They want to be able to use TikTok without you knowing where they live and have freedom of speech and be able to have the opinions what they have without the fear of someone coming to their house or whatever the article might be. That is doxing. So any private, so basically doxing is names that they've not given, that they have not, they don't give you permission to, to, to have. Address, um, yeah, full name, address, those, those kind of things that they have not given you. Whether it's on TikTok, whether someone's a leaked on TikTok, whether it's in an article, in a newspaper, they have not given you permission to declare, to, 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 you know, to declare that on here. That's doxing. No, you can't. You can't um, AHH. I've had this conversation with the police already. You can't. Any, you, just Google it. Basically, you can read the article because it's put in the public eye, right? But what you can't do is reveal their identity. That's doxing. Because they don't want you to know their identity. Yeah? And that's the same with me, even though people have leaked my address, or I've, I've probably leaked it myself, I think, yeah, I have, you know, and it's gone around on TikTok. It doesn't give the other people, because there's new viewers here that join TikTok every day, yeah, that don't know my address. So it doesn't give the right, wow, well, it's already on TikTok, I'm going to give it to this person, or I'm going to go in someone's box and dox it and read out my address. Because that person that might have just joined might not have it, but now they have it. So that's an extra person that's got my address. And I've not given you permission to have that, to, to, to do that. That's doxing. Hey, Corey. Facts. Yes, Lynn, that's facts. And I have spoken to the police myself. Yeah, true. It is true. So like you, for example, Evil Sprout, right? No, say Emma, for example, right? You, 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 your name might not be Emma, right? But say I find out who you are because we become friends, and then I find we fall out, and I find an article about you in the in the newspaper or on the internet, right? And I'm, I can read the article, right? But what I can't do is is reveal your full name and your address or any details about you, even though it's public, because that's me doing it out of malice, isn't it? Because people don't need to know that information. And believe me, I've had this with the police already. Because I read out an article on TikTok, right? And even I didn't read out, read out certain bits of it, um, I, I think I might have read out some person, like a name. Um, Toxing. <laughs> Oh, was it going to be all about me tomorrow? Me, me and EQ. Yay! <laughs> I don't disappoint. Hmm. I didn't actually think about it at the time, right? At least you own it, and yeah. So the majority, so a lot of people have actually doxxed on here, and they probably haven't don't even realise it. Have you? Oh, thank you, Emma. Oh, God. <sighs> well, at least it's Friday tomorrow. They tried to break you and failed then until, yeah. Real Tinker Brothers, please don't do anything. Believe me, they don't. You know, it depends on your situation in the case and what's happened. But you say that they don't, you, you, they do. Well, you know, Linz, I hope you don't mind me saying this, Linz has got a court case against someone on TikTok for a hate crime, you know, and, um, yeah, I'm not going to say who, you probably know who. It really depends what it is. Yeah, I did, yeah. Yeah. I mean, listen, if I, listen, if I, you know, kind of, you know, I'd, I'd have a, I'd, listen, I'd go to court 100%. Did you and EQ fall out? No. 
I just get fucking mad sometimes. I just, I just get, I've just had enough of people. Do you know what I mean? I don't need them; they need me. Do you know what I mean? It's a facts. I don't need anyone on this bloody app. Thank goodness, uh, the rest to follow. I'm not even going to talk about tea on my FYP tomorrow because I'm not even going to give you the clout. I will talk about the situation, but I'm not going to say who it was with. Thank you, Evil Spell. I do like my events. DG is, is requesting, but I know that he likes he likes just chill out and things. And just, you know me, I'm I'm off on one tonight, and I so I won't accept him. Eight o'clock. She called a girl uh, B B. He could, it went crazy. You know what? Right. Tip for tip. You know what I mean. You know, the thing is, this is what the app, it makes me so mad. And this certain person does it all the time. Don't dish it out if you cannot take it. Oh, thank you for the chicken. I look good. <laughs> that looks hilarious for fuck's sake. Thank you so much. Don't dish it out if you can't take it. There's never, it's never okay to be racist, right? But it's never okay to be transphobic either. So from what I heard... She was transphobic to EQ first, yeah? Okay, and so she kind of made a point by saying what she said because of what was said to her. Tip for tip. You can't complain about it. I am so sick and tired of the step, I swear to God. The hypocrisy on here, I swear. I am so sick. Oh, here we go again. I am so sick and tired yeah, of people saying this bullshit. I'm surprised they haven't got banana yet. For fuck's sake, what's going on? Um, people are tired of this bullshit, yeah, where people dish it out and they spill out all this bullshit from their gob and then they get it back and it's like, <gasps> fuck off with your bullshit. Tit for tat, you have no case, piss off. <laughs> see, I'm telling the truth. See, listen, you can't be transphobic and then complain about racism. Thank you, Emma. Mm. And I said she had three legs. What does that? What do you mean three legs? What does that mean? Ah, oh, yeah, it's a bit dopey, isn't he? It says facts. Listen, EQ has no apology. I wouldn't apologise to nothing. Now listen, we all know, listen, EQ is not racist. She said it because of the, you know, it was, it was basically, I'm going to give you a taste of your own medicine. Wake up, Ange, three legs. I don't, what does that mean? Yes, I'm fucking tired. Yeah. <laughs> what does that mean? I love you like this, you say how it is, yeah. I think I love it, but I... Oh, no, I need to follow the crowd. Two legs. Oh, for fuck's sake. See, I have to think about that because I'm not fucking transphobic. Oh, well, actually, you don't need to be actually transphobic to say that, I suppose, but... I don't know. Well, there you go. So they can't be sitting there complaining about racism. I mean, listen, I understand that it does affect the whole community. Do you get what I'm saying? <sighs> but, uh, I don't know. Tip for tip now. Yeah, it was a little bit mental today, wasn't it? And there's me thinking, I'll oh, have a quiet night. Yeah, yeah, exactly the same. Oh, thank you, Kill. <laughs> School playground, yeah. Well, this is what I'm trying to say, isn't it? You win at my mum. I win at my mum, so I win at yours, and I say, oh my god, that's disgusting. 
I'll say it again if you want. <laughs> this head, man, it really does, um, oh. Oh, I don't listen. I don't need fucking anyone on the set. You know what I mean? Not one person. Looking for some. Oh God, I need to go to the shop. Are they open yet? You need the coal. Well, I, yeah, well, my, this is my community. Yes, I love my coal, yes. I love all the coal members. No A, no T, no oxygen energy. 100% evil spot, yeah. Who's A? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I might not even play that video that somebody sent me just now about that. Fuck it. I don't want, I won't even play that video. You can actually private messages, so why do people think you can share it on social media? Private messages? No, you can't. I've never shown private messages on TikTok. See, to me that's also doxing, but I know some people might say it isn't. Belly Buster, that one. Here's a Belly Buster. Just have a good night, yeah. So you can't shoot messages, so definitely not addresses on here. No, you can't share addresses. With sh no. It's <sighs> over 12, but I was about 2 o'clock. Oh, <sighs> Yeah, I'm doing it tomorrow. I, yeah, it won't get here today though, will it? How did you know I run out? All right. I know that really pissed me off when Michelle said, well, her address is on TikTok, so it's fine. No, it's not okay. How do you know just when someone, because someone doesn't have kids living with them, they don't have children visiting them, giving out misinformation. Do you know what I mean? Because she has a vendetta against me. Nothing but a bully, that woman, I swear to God. You know, that has to give unis to get attention from men. Weird behaviour. You new people come on TikTok all the time. Exactly. Why don't you just give it to everybody that comes on? Every new person. Well, it's okay because it's already on here. You know what I mean? Don't listen to this stupid cow. I never doxed anything on him. I still don't remember. You know what I mean? The inquiries when they do not, do not meet her. What do you mean, then? I've got my boxes on. I was wondering why no one's joining. Have I got them on? Oh, shit, I haven't got them on. No, I have got them on, have I? I don't know. I have got them on, and I? Yes. Yeah, I, Joel, I can focus on is your shadow. <laughs> <laughs> It looks like a witch eating, like, looking at a cauldron or something. <laughs> you can see the witch's hat and then the massive long witch's nose. Oh, it's funny. Do you know what, Ange? You're in the right. You're, you're absolutely in the right about the doxing situation. Yeah. It's just crazy. You need to take responsibility for what they do. Because I'm telling you, I don't dox, but the next person might. You know what I mean? 
The next person might say, well, fuck you, you know, you dox me, I'm going to take a shit, you're a parent, I'm doxing you back. You know, they might just take that attitude. People need to take responsibility, you know, and look after their children and make sure, and keep them safe. Not be going around doxing information. Oh, I'm so mad and energy. I'm not, I'm not mad about what, I'm not about mad about this, this T woman because I'm reporting her. But the, the one, Michelle one, you know, that likes to do blackout me saying, well, it's already on TikTok, it's fine. Yeah. yeah, do you know what? I think it's the attitude of it's just Angie. It's just you, so it's all it's okay, it doesn't matter. And you know what? And I do believe that that is an ethos that they do have, genuinely. Yeah, and so I don't it's fine. That. I've got my mother here, my niece visits here. You know what I mean? And you know what? It's, dogs can get you two years in, in prison. It's not dogs in itself, the outcome of it. If something fucking happens to me tonight, excuse my language here, yeah, I will blame that, that woman that just dogs it tonight. So how you can fucking sleep, God knows. Do you know what I mean? You can get fucking psychopaths or, you know what I mean? <laughs>